Hello there, I'm Richard Greensmith, I'm Operations Manager um, at the University of Derby Buxton campus um, and I work at the Devonshire Dome. The catering outlets, we have two student-led catering outlets for student feeding. Um, they both serve different functions depending on what the student wishes to, to eat during the day. We have a fine dining restaurant which is operated by the students and that runs five days a week. We also have internal hospitality to our uh, members of staff and senior management and we also have banqueting up to a thousand guests. So the new kitchen was created out of an existing cafe area where food used to be served from and the till stations were in there. The difficulty we had with the space to create a kitchen was the confines of the angular wall and being able to recreate a traditional style restaurant service area that could service the restaurant and the teaching needs for the students and also the large scale 900 banquets that we would have to service throughout the year. All of the refrigeration we have in the new kitchen is from Williams. With the site historically being a, a cafe outlet and it's been difficult to work with him because of the angles of the walls, what we needed to have was a system that could be built with a very low threshold so that we could wheel in the thousand plated desserts and main courses. It obviously needs to be robust because of the use of it. It needs to be quiet because it's in a training kitchen and we also need features like the soft close system so that the doors aren't left open because we're working with students who don't double check that the door is closed after them. So that was a real feature that we found beneficial. When we're buying for students, we need to prepare them for the workplace. So what they need to be able to use is pieces of equipment that you will see in any establishment. We also need to cater for pieces of equipment that you'll see in specialist establishment. So we need to have a range of equipment from your basic gas burner through to your sous vide cooking. One of the attributes we need to consider for catering equipment, especially working with students and um, external caterers that are coming in and using the facilities, is how robust this equipment is, how easy it is to clean. Students is not used as heavy, but because they're not used to working with equipment, it needs to take the knocks and scrapes that a normal operation wouldn't give it. So the blast chiller that we have within the kitchen which is able to cater for the um, large volumes of banqueting is very very simple to use. The, um, there's three probes within the um, blast chiller which can go into the food which monitor the temperature of the, the internal cooking temperature or the chilling temperature of the food that's, that's been placed in there and the time that it, it takes to drop it down. There's only three buttons in order to operate it and then the system does the rest. We're very pleased with the refrigeration that we've received from Williams. It was a difficult site to work with. Um, they were able to be bespokely built. The, the, the kitchens have been um, very thoughtfully designed. Um, it, I think it's a difficult project from the start because of the size of the room and the scope of the works that we require the kitchen to carry out. So it's a very difficult brief for it to fulfil, which I'm glad to say is has been well received.